Well, this is an outstanding kickboxer making his way to the UFC octagon right now. Very interesting stylistic matchup here tonight. Just an outstanding arsenal of kicks. Great punching technique. Power in both hands. Works the lead leg. Not afraid to work the body. Just a complete kickboxer here, now plying his trade in mixed martial arts. A dangerous proposition for anyone caught in his striking range. This guy is an excellent striker. What he wants to do is utilize his footwork, his takedown defense, and land hard strikes to get the victory. Nigeria, but now he calls Auckland, New Zealand home. He is the last style bender, Israel Adesanya. And really, ever since his UFC debut, this is a guy that has really rung true with the modern MMA fans, a crowd-pleasing style. And he's got the takedown defense that allows him to keep the fight in his striking realm. So as the challenges get stiffer, let's see if Adesanya can continue to realize success here in the UFC. This guy has ridiculous hand speed. If this fight comes to a striking exchange, he will have a distinct advantage. Our tail of the tape for this much anticipated middleweight encounter. So a more than five year gap between these two fighters when it comes to the age, with similar height and some differences in reach. All right, here is Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, this fight is three rounds in the UFC middleweight division. Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner, a kickboxer holding a professional record of eight wins, one loss. He stands six feet two inches tall, weighing in at 185 pounds, fighting out of Toronto, Ontario, Canada, the Nightman. And now, introducing his opponent, fighting out of the red corner, a mixed martial artist holding a professional record of. 16 wins, no losses. He stands six feet four inches tall, weighing in at 185 pounds. Israel, the last title bender, Adesanya! And with the attributes, our referee in charge, Herb Dean. Herb Dean, our referee for this one. You ready to fight? Ready. All right, we are underway now. Good to have you with us as we broadcast live from Scotiabank Arena in Toronto, Ontario. Well, if you talk to Israel Adesanya, he'll tell you, I don't force the finish. I like to let it come to me, and that is certainly what happened in his UFC debut. But one thing to keep an eye out for is the takedown defense, because everybody is shooting at those legs of Adesanya, and more often than not, they haven't been able to keep him down consistently. So Adesanya has worked hard on that realm of his game, and let's see if the takedown defense holds up yet again tonight. Oh, he blocked that offense, Joe. All right, so first round is underway. You know when it comes to his strategy, a lot of it is rooted in his kicking game, has massive power, whether he's attacking the head, the legs, or the body. So let's see how early he can find his range with those kicks here tonight. And both guys really throwing with authority. Watch the shot here, Joe. That one hurt. Adesanya gets caught with that punch. Got to shore up the defense here. Just over three minutes now to go in round one. So he lands his first leg kick there, Joe. He talked a lot about this during fight week to upset the movement and the forward motion of his opponent. Certainly off to a good start in that department. Body kick now by Adesanya. Trying to establish that jab once again. Tagged him. Lands oh, a beautiful, beautiful there. Elbow. And now he lands a combination. Try to establish that jab. Nice defense on the single leg takedown. You can tell he's worked on that. Adesanya gets up, and somewhat surprisingly, despite having a dominant position on the ground, he wants to take this fight back to the feet. Nice inside leg kick. Splits the guard and connects with the punch. Lands that kick to the leg. Well, it's one thing to have length.
think that's another thing to use it, and he does it as well as anyone. Nice kick there by Adesanya. He lands a Superman punch. Adesanya's knee strike there is blocked, so no damage inflicted. Oh! It appears that cut is getting worse. Going to the leg kick now, and it's there. Nice job by Adesanya. Final seconds. So a strong five minutes down. All right, that's the end of the round. You see the cut on his lip, ladies and gentlemen, is only getting worse. Likely gonna need to get stitched up after the fact, and blood in and around the mouth area could upset his breathing pattern. Not a good reality for him here tonight. And here's another beautiful leg kick. And there's another excellent leg kick. Really excellent striking being displayed in that round. You ready to fight? Ready. Second round underway. Starting off this round, you gotta think he's probably still hurt from that last round. He's gonna wanna move and avoid taking damage early. Adesanya gets caught with that punch. Slightly deflected. Oh, head kick. How about that shin? Yep, not a ton behind it, but it landed. Finds his range with the jab. Inside leg kick lands. Out of range with that one. Well, he's always on the counterattack, but a nice leg kick there by Adesanya. Well, he's landed some excellent shots in this fight tonight, but more often than not, it has been one and done. So the emphasis now moving forward, combinations. Throw your punches in bunches and really try to force the issue and get your opponent out of it. A oh, beautiful kick to the body there, and he just left himself wide open for that strike. for an opening down low. Well, if he's gonna slow his opponent down at all, Joe, he's gotta think about mixing things up a little bit. Translation, some strikes to the body. Israel Adesanya gets caught with that punch. He'd be wise to get those hands up. Just misses with the jab there. Inside leg kick. Under two minutes to go. That bruise on his outer thigh is really starting to swell up bad. <laughs> Circling to his right here, trying to avoid those big shots from his opponent. Keeps going back to that jab, keeps throwing that jab, but unable to land. Oh, oh, he got tagged! He got tagged! He's got him hurt here. Under a minute, and now to go in round two. And a nice kick. Well, he's really picked up the pace here in round two. Much more aggressive now here, and starting to find himself in the pocket. Well, he continues to offer up the kick here, but just misses with that one. Wind it up on the right there to no avail. That's a hard uppercut to the head. Two rounds in the books. Great work in this round. Keep that pace up. Wow, I'm impressed. You really broke him down with your striking. Keep that going. The inside low kick is awesome. All right, let's check out some of the action from that round. Here's a perfect kick to the body. And here's another clean shot that lands. Some really well-placed strikes on display in that round. The OG Ariane Celeste in the building with us. 
Ready to fight? Ready. Third and final round. Inside leg kick lands and immediately a mark on his opponent. Well, we wondered earlier why there weren't as many body strikes. He's making up for lost time here. Shot to the body connects, and that bear's watching. That's gonna hurt this opponent. He just whips that punch in. Wow. Adesanya gets caught with that punch. He's treading water now. Gotta find a way to move those oh, feet. Oh, good kick. Total strikes. Oh, spinning back fist lands. Asking you shall receive. Finally, a shot to the body. First one to the midsection from him, I believe. He changes stances and switches southpaw. Oh! He's in deep danger right now. Deep oh. danger. A front kick to the face. Body kick, look at that. Stuffs the tape down there. How good is his takedown defense? Well-timed kick there, Joe. Under three minutes to go in our third round. Oh! Oh, he is starting to put a lot more pressure on his opponent here, Joe. A lot lighter on his feet. These last oh, couple rounds to this the face. He's in a lot of trouble. Hard straight punch. Oh! What a leg kick. Much improved defensively as he blocks the shot. He's doing a very good job of parrying and blocking all the shots that are coming towards his head. Just out of the range with that right hand. How about that chin? Oh, spinning back fist. He didn't telegraph that one at all. Missed on the strike attempt there. His stamina has really failed him here tonight. He's got to figure out a way to preserve some energy as this fight moves forward. That one hurt. So clock starting to become a factor here. Oh, man, that cut looks terrible. He's bleeding like crazy. I wouldn't be surprised if they stopped the fight with that cut at some point. Wow! This could be it right here. Oh! He hurt him. He hurt him bad. Nice leg kick. Good defense there. And here's the end of the fight. Beautiful strike here, lands on target. The official decision is in, it resides with Bruce Buffett. Ladies and gentlemen, after three rounds, we go to the judges' scorecards for a decision. All three judges score this contest 30-27. Declaring the winner by unanimous decision, Israel, the last style bender, Adesanya. He is the last style bender, Israel Adesanya, and he gets another UFC win here tonight. And he has really been critical of his past performances inside the octagon, but a whole lot to like out of this effort here tonight. Gonna be interesting to hear how Adesanya felt about what he was able to accomplish inside this arena tonight.